we are here with the winner, the queen of the Highgate 10K champs. Um, congratulations, Rona Orton. Thank you very well, much. Welcome to the sofa as well. This is my sofa from home, so I hope you enjoy it it's here. Very comfy. It's a luxury. Um, what a great race! Like, like. Um, so for people who haven't seen the race, um, Jess Coulson went out very, very hard. Yeah. Um, looked as though it was going to be a clear leader. You stuck to your guns and came through. Yeah. Um, at what point did you feel as though you were coming into it? Was it a judge performance or was it Jess coming back to you? Um, I think it was Jess, as you say, Jess pulled it out really hard and kept going at a really good pace. And my focus was just trying to keep the pace going. Um, so I wasn't, um, I mean, Jess is a phenomenal athlete. So I didn't think I was going to catch her. So I was just focusing on counting off the laps and trying to keep my time going for my time. Um, and when she got closer, I was like, oh, I can like, really push on her and pull her back. So that was really good to finish like that. And as soon as you, you know, just like it is with distance running, as soon as you caught a bit of a smell, okay, because you got a bit of a scent there, okay, yeah. you went in for the kill, and that yeah. was very, very impressive. Yeah, the competitive instinct comes out suddenly, and you're like, oh, there's a medal here, so um, I was pleased with that. So the evening is called um, the Night of 10,000 PBs. Yep. Congratulations on a PB. Yeah. Um, what, you knocked off 30 seconds there? Yep. No, um, yep. From From w when did you run your last, where was your previous 10K? Um, so my last 10K, I did a road one, um, at Leeds Abbey Dash and ran 33.05 there and then I did my 33.07 was here last year um, so. and wow you ran here last year yeah um, wasn't as um, successful as this year without no. a doubt because yeah. you didn't win okay but what what was the big difference from last year to this year weather I think last year I was aiming to run about 32.50 um, and I just got beaten by the weather I think and um, I'm inexperienced as well. I think. With all due um, respect, you're from Scotland, though. Yeah, I know. I know. I should be used to it. Um, it should be luxury. It should be luxury. It should be luxury. Tonight was luxury, so it's okay. perfect. Um, um, no, I think I think it's more experience this year. I'm just a bit more confident, knowing that I've been running with the time in training. I know that if I can get up to the pace, I can do it. So I was confident that I could do it. It's just about pushing through the pain and keeping concentrated. So I had a fantastic um, support team with me. So I had someone literally at like every spot around the track shouting, really? like, keep me going. And, so what, and, what, and what was the crowd like? I hope you're hearing actually the noise and this interview, yeah. okay, but how, how good it's, is the, the crowd? The track is amazing because you find yourself like picking up down the back straight and certainly in the earlier case where you're feeling quite good, I was like really like, pulling myself back a little bit because you come down here and you get excited and you're like, woo! Okay, hang on, 23 laps to go, we'll just keep it going. They're getting a bit rowdy now, okay? Yeah, they the bar, are, yeah. they've already sold, yeah, they've sold out of alcohol, yeah. they had to go out and get some more alcohol in. <laughs> it's um, a great atmosphere though, it really is, and it's like, it's so exciting to be part of something where people are so excited about it as well, which is it's really nice. Um, it's definitely um, one of the things that I love compared to cross country, I think, is the sense that it's, it's compact and you've got this crowd the whole way around, which is really I, nice. I think we should get Ben Pochi to organise some cross country meets, okay, where we, where we get some laps yeah. and get something going. Yeah. So, the men's race is kicking off uh, as we speak. What is this race going to do? What's the, what's the future of your season? Um, what are you hoping for? What are the dreams? Um, aiming, hopefully, to get to the 10k at the under 20 degrees. Um, so that was, that's my main focus this summer. Um, so up until then, just do some more 5k's and 15s and get some speed back in the legs. Um, so yeah, just try and keep ticking over, hopefully. You are, you are the queen. Can I just... Uh... <laughs> Can I please just give you uh, your crown? Definitely Congratulations not on not just a, a, not just winning, okay, but Ooh. doing it in such a great fashion. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Hope to see you next year. Thank you very much. Thank you.